Mm. Doc, look, I'm having some greens to make sure I get one. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah. Habibi, come to Dubai. Come to Dubai. <laughs> Special day right here at the Emirates Airline Festival of Literature. We are on day three and I am with the CEO, Ahlam Baluki, who is walking me to the green room right now because we are going to meet two super guests and we are doing an amazing food tour today. It's gonna to be superb, it's gonna be superb. First of all, I've got Dr. Salha Mahmoud, who is Master Chef 2017. And the second of all, side by side, Philip Khouri, who is an amazing chef doing wonderful things in the dessert scene with vegan ingredients. Super excited. We are here. This is the green room. So this is where everybody comes and hangs out. And I mean everybody who's involved with speaking or moderating or anything like that. All the authors and stuff like that. So we are just walking in right here. There you go. The CEO once again there we go we found dr salha right there oh amazing i'm so excited how is day three guys what's day three like uh we were all very tired really yeah i thought it was 10 p.m <laughs> I was shocked to find out you guys are doing an amazing job day one and day two were super i just met dr salha we just need to wait for for philip so i'll be back in a little bit you'll take care of them until i come back all right go fix my car lots of students coming over on day three, right here. Look at that, amazing. This is brilliant actually. Lots going on over here and, and you know this is where stories happen. Superb, the 16th edition of the festival. It is absolutely amazing. Oh my God, I just realized that I actually gave my car to the valet and did not give them the key. This is the typical Emirati guy. Look, parked like this. This is what Philip said. <laughs> nice to meet you. I, I didn't do it, I swear. They, they, they parked it for me, but please. So this is the first one we're going to go into. Veganesha. This is right next to another, like this restaurant, by the way, has a lot of vegetarian vegan dishes as well. Superb. Puran Mal, very famous, I think probably 30 years old. This one I've never been to, but we'll give Thank it a shot. You. Yeah, let's go. Oh, so awesome. So they've actually got Southeast Asian food, Chinese food, Sizzlers, Thalis, wow. Risotto. All right. So, smash, smash. Right, so we've got a spoon in. Spoon in the sprouted lentils. This is the first time I've actually seen sprouted lentils inside um, yeah. food, which is very gut healthy. Yeah, oh nice. Followed by some tamarind chutney. Got it. And then some chili liquid. How hot is this? I feel like it's going to be hot because it's bright green colour. <laughs> <laughs> Good. Mike and I will, will learn from you guys and kind of... <laughs> yeah? Spicy? In a good way. Yeah? Oh, amazing. Yeah? All right, good. Oh, look at it. Ooh, look at the puris. Wow. Oh my god. Oh, I would have loved to see that cooking. I want to film you uh, eating ah. one. Oh, nice, okay. Sweet. Yes. But you're not an Asian unless you do it with your mouth. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, I'm losing all the liquid. So that's very good. Mm. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Yum. Mm -hmm. That's really good. Mmm. Yum. 
Oh, that must be amazing. Nothing like these fresh coconuts too, so. <laughs> amazing. Hooray. <laughs> mm. What do you guys think? Oh. Mike, which one do you want to try? Very interesting. Yeah? Is it uh, pawn? Nice. Pawn pawn style mitai. Thank you. You took bites out of it. I'm going to do the entire thing. Mm. Good. Mm. Very nice. Mm. Not the first restaurant, guys. Loved it. Yeah? Yummy, yummy. On a scale of 1 to 10? Oh, that's always a hard one. I would say, like, I'm quite strict, so 7. 7, okay. Oh, it brought me so much joy, so I'm going to go 8. 8. No, oh. <laughs> wow. I'll give them. I'll give them an eight point five. It was good. It was good. It was good. It was a good. Uh, it was a good restaurant. Like I said, I think you know everybody adds a little bit of love to their sandwiches and their their dishes. I definitely like a couple of dishes somewhere else, but they were tasty. They were good. So. I mean, I'm strict, so for me, seven. <laughs> seven and a half. Oh yeah. Good. Like oh. nothing touches ten. You know, apart from. Ooh. Levels. Okay. <laughs> All right. Oh yeah. That's it. Yeah. yeah. You said the magic words right there. <laughs> the two words put together. Okay, let's go get some Marathi food. Assalamu alaikum. So, this is the station, yeah. the Rajag station. He's gonna come in and set up. Yeah. Um, predominantly run by Southern Iranians. Uh huh. And they'll usually have like multiple brothers. I've seen you do this on yeah, time. Yeah, yes, yeah, 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 yeah. Do you know what's reminded yeah, me? The chips? Omani chips, yeah. 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 <laughs> I mean, this is, it's, it's amazing. This, yeah. this thing you can't get anywhere, anywhere else. And that... Is the, is the archivista. Yeah, so they, this is how they make it. And it's such a skill because they do it with their hands. That thing is super hot. Yeah. So this is the, I, I told them to make only one this way with the chips and everything. And then the other ones are with everything except the chips. Just look at the texture and everything, huh, Chef? Mm. Yeah? It's got that. Yeah? So good, right? Well, yeah. Yeah, I mean you can't go wrong with nice crispy bread. It's got egg in there as well, so. Look this recipe. Yeah. No, I'm a, I'm a sugar feed. <laughs> yeah. Mmm. Mm -hmm. nice, the crisp on that. Yeah. Mmm. This is something special as well. All right. You ready to see what's inside? Mushroom. Fava beans. beans. Fava, Fava beans. beans. Large. Is it full? Full. But this is made in just brine. Very nice. Phenomenal. So by the way, these are a lot of the fools that you would have had would be the smaller ones. Yes. Yeah. Not these They're large. Massive. But these are these are usually it's on roids. yeah these are uh, dehydrated uh, fava beans that would be rehydrated and then cooked like this to just perfection brine again uh, the juice I love the juice so let me tell you how this is how do you pop it from the center and get rid of the skin I like the skin you can and I, I tend to like have like five or six without the skin and then a couple with the skin five or six but. But generally, that's how people here would, would eat it. Oh, actually, try it just with the flesh. It's really good. Mm. So, Bumi, it reminds me of that. Really nice. I mean, it, it actually nice, is right? exactly really what nice. it reminds me of. So, what do you think of that restaurant? Oh, too good. I yeah? love those chickpeas. Out of 10? Uh, nine and a half. Ooh! It's a 10 for me. Ooh! Ten. Ooh! It's always a 10 for me, that's that spot, but amazing. God, fantastic. It's definitely an experience you don't want to miss. It's like, why is it not a 10? Yeah. <laughs> awesome. Okay, so that's where we're going to, right there. Seva. Seva. It's to serve, right? Oh, is that right? Yeah, oh. to, to give service to. Oh, nice. So it's like, hidden. Interesting, it's Seva. Like a little sanctuary. Yeah, you'll see how they've they've built the place really nice. So there's a dinner tonight as well. I told the Hilam, I was like, I don't think we're going to eat dinner. After all this. <laughs> so this is their store. I don't know if you want to go and have a quick look. Hello. And 
And now to the side is, it's very, uh, it's very uh, Bali-esque, the whole yeah. place. Yeah, the place is super cool. Hello, how are you? You're gonna like their healing macrobiotic soup. Ah. Dreamy wild mushroom. Yeah. Mm. I like it. I have to say, I don't know why this layer is grey coloured. That's my only criticism. I think it's just the banana. Mm. <laughs> Macho for banana. Mm. Quite rich. So coconut's basically there for texture, huh? Yeah. I mean, it feels very much like guacamole. Yeah, it has Pretty a much, right? feel to it. It's like a pimped up guacamole. <laughs> yeah, that's true, yeah. <laughs> In a good way. Mm. <laughs> All right, who's gonna try the dynamite first? Okay. Let's see, what is it called dynamite? Spicy. Mm. Yeah? Yummy. Is there coconut? Pretty creamy. Or Oh, that's a thick cream. Yeah. Mmm, very nice. Doc, look, I'm having some greens to make sure very I get... Healthy. <laughs> very healthy. Very healthy. All right. Oh, God. Um, I'd say probably seven-ish. Seven-ish? Um, not bad. Okay. Seven-ish, not bad, seven. yeah. Seven food, ten vibes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That's a good vibes. one. Yeah, yeah, great vibes. vibes. Yeah. And I get it. Yeah. Do you reckon if we had that at the beginning, the rating would be higher? Are we feeling a little bit full or no? It's always higher. It would be a little bit, right? Well, a little bit. Maybe, maybe, maybe up to seven and a half, eight. Not, not more than that. Yeah. I always feel sorry yeah. for whoever yeah. gets tasted last. Yeah, yeah. That's true. <laughs> the expectations are. Oh, yeah. yeah. Order to okay, good. But they have a lot of things on the menu. We gotta try some more things on the yeah. menu. But yeah, interesting. Okay, cool. The vibe is the cool bit about it this is. place, actually. Yeah, it's very chilled. Yeah. yeah. Malah, you guys have never eaten here before? No. Super popular in Malah. It's been around for ages. And they do falafel as well, like really fresh ones. Are you sure? Yeah, absolutely. Malah, yeah. <laughs> so there we go, fresh falafels. And then come and check out the skewers. Come and look, shukran. Check out there. Look how big that skewer is. Look at it. That's probably like, I don't know, maybe 70, 80 kilo. Come on, meat kilo or like come? Meat kilo? The money in kilo. It comes 100 kilos. Wow. Once again, this is basically the manoush cheese oh. and then they put chicken shawarma in it but it also has garlic paste in it. Yeah. Yeah. I can smell it. Lovely. It's amazing. Oh yeah. Mm. Yeah? Mm. 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 <laughs> is it what? Best chicken sandwich in the world. <laughs> Yummy. Yeah, it is so like, you will not get this, you can't get this anywhere else. These guys are the pioneers of this and so far it hasn't caught on. So people aren't doing this like mainstream and stuff. Um, you're sitting at home at like 11 at night and you're a bit hungry. And you're like, do you know what I really crave in London? This. Do you want this? And yeah. And you just feel sad for a bit. <laughs> Well, listen, the answer to that, and actually the answer to everything is Habibi, come to Dubai. Come to Dubai. <laughs> <True>. <laughs> After a night out, mm. Friday nights, and you're starving. Mm. This bread. You like meat pickle? Yeah, mm. it's so good. A chili pickle. Juicy one. Those would be spicy or not? Yeah. 
strawberry juice, and it's not it's not like this liquid strawberry juice. Proper like strawberry in a blender. Cheers. Yeah. <laughs> this is too much fun. This is just too much fun. I feel like a child. It's so good. Like it's a it's a gem. So full and so happy. <laughs> yeah. So this would be the last rating that we have. What would you rate those? Oh, that is getting so a nine and a half. Definitely nine and a half for me. Ten. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> these guys rock. They're so good. I tell you, these guys. These guys are an institution. We'll be back. We're out of here. <laughs>